Okay, y'all, one of my grails is here. Now, if you have not seen my grail video, I will link it below so you can check this out. But I am ecstatic that this is here. Well, sort of here. And you're going to see what I mean in just a second. I don't want to spoil it. But I am super duper thrilled that this has happened. And it happened so fast um, between this being able to get this and then the last time that I actually lost out on one of these. So here is a box or a bag full of clothes. But what's important about these clothes is most of them I don't care about at all. Like not even remotely interested in most of this stuff. Um, some of this might be actual Pleasant Company stuff. But anyway, I'm going to, um, I'm looking to see if any of this is tagged. It's not. Um, some of this stuff is kind of nice. Oh, that's Patat. So, just keep going. Let's move this stuff out of the way. Because we're not interested in it. And let me get to the good stuff. Some of these really might be pleasant company things, but I'm going to have to um, look at them. That's cute. All right. So what could I be so excited about that's in this bag? Let's just dump it. Let's dump it and see. So I've got some boots here with shoes in it. Let's see. Here's a bag. What's in the bag? Like a sleeping bag, I think. Alright, trying to get to the grail part. Sorry, this is, there's a lot of stuff in here, actually. I'm really surprised by how much stuff is in this bag. Okay, here we go. Do you guys recognize this from one of my earlier videos? This is an Ingle Pup uh, Snow White outfit that was exclusive exclusive to Walt Disney World and Disneyland. You could only get these in the Epcot Pavilion um, at Disney World or there was a store at Disneyland you could get them at. And I already have this one. So which one could possibly be my grail? If you remember from the other video, that is the Ariel outfit. I have it in my hands, y'all. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So this is the legit aerial outfit from Ingle Pop. It is made in Germany from the Epcot Pavilion. And this seller is actually from Florida, so I feel sure these are from the Epcot Pavilion and not from Disneyland. I finally have it, I finally have it. And it came with the shoes as well. I am just so stinking thrilled about it because I lost out on the last aerial. But you guys might be thinking like, well, what about the doll? I have already placed an order with Mr. Engel at the Engel Pup Factory. He is making me an aerial doll. The thing is, is that he can make, you know, he has the same molds and wigs and eyes and things, but what he doesn't have is he's not able to do the Disney outfits because they had a special agreement with Disney about that. So I'm getting a brand new Ariel doll and she is going to wear the Ariel costume and I am like so excited because this is the closest thing I'm going to get to being able to make my own doll at the Epcot Pavilion, which is something I always wanted to do. And if you haven't seen my video about that, I'll link it below as well so you can check out the whole history of this and why it's so exciting to me. Um, but I'm just like beside myself. I am beside myself with excitement that I was able to get this. Now, the things that I got extra as well, for those of you, this is a red wig. I don't know. Um, I think it, maybe they probably were uh, cosplaying as Ariel. I would imagine whoever had the slot probably had an American Girl or, or a Batat doll that they were just dressing up. So I've also got the Tinkerbell outfit and the Tinkerbell outfit is sort of rare. Like it's a little bit harder to find um, than some of the others. And it is also um, tagged, Ingle Pup, made in Germany. So 
from the Epcot Pavilion. I also already have a Tinkerbell, but this Tinkerbell outfit has her shoes as well. And then I also got, which I already have, another Belle outfit, um, which is tagged. Let's see, where's the tag? Uh, there it is, Engel Pup, made in Germany. Now you could buy these outfits separately at the Epcot Pavilion, but they were $80 a piece. So what am I gonna do with my duplicates? I'm gonna sell the duplicates that I have here because I don't need them, I already have them. So um, if you're interested in them, I'm gonna sell them uh, for $40, including shipping in the US. So 40 bucks shipped. If you want one of them, uh, just leave me a comment below and we'll, we'll work it out so that you can purchase them. But, and see what I would recommend to do is if you're like me, and you have this great sentimental feeling about these things is the outfits are what's important because Mr. Engel can still make the dolls. He still has a doll factory in Germany and he still accepts orders. Um, he did tell me shipping would be delayed because of the COVID situation, but that's what I, I, you know, I've enjoyed doing collecting outfits and now I'm getting my own custom doll. So it's the closest that I can get to having my doll built at Epcot. I am like, I'm so excited. I just, I can't even express to you guys how thrilled I am to finally, I'm going to finally have Ariel here. But anyway, like I said, if you're interested in one of the other outfits, just shoot me a message and let me know um, because they are... Uh, they're really special and you can, I can give you his contact information so you can reach out to get your own doll made. And so it'll be the same situation. You can have the same sort of special situation where you're having your own doll made, but you're able to put the Disney outfit on it. But anyway, y'all, that's why I said my grail is sort of here. The doll is, he's making the doll right now. He actually sent me an email this morning that he was working on her. And I ordered her, I went ahead and ordered her with a traditional German outfit as well, just so she would come dressed. And I think it's really cool to have that whole building experience directly from him. But uh, I will be probably displaying her, not probably, I'll definitely be displaying her in this outfit. So I am uh, I'm so excited. So anyway, guys, um, if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. I just wanted to update y'all because I got the, the, the grail that I talked about not that long ago. And I've been watching for Ariel for a long time. And just the fact that I was able to um, get the outfit, that's the important part to me. I actually prefer when I can find the outfits and then have the dolls uh, made new for me. So I think that's so cool. Like best possible situation ever. So if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and we will see you guys in the next video bye bye